All right, so let's talk about containers and why you should bother about containers, mainly Docker and the ecosystem which includes Kubernetes. Now, the key part or the key theme about containers is the standardization and the consistency that you get. Okay, let's take an analogy with the real world shipping container. Let's say if you want to ship some goods from one part of the world to the other part of the world, it could be, you know, oil, it could be cranes, it could be cars. Uh, the way you handle it, the way you package it, the way you ship it, and the way you handle it at the, you know, at the destination would depend on the kind of goods that you had earlier, right? If it were cars, you would handle it in a certain way. If it were a grain, you would do it in a certain other way, right? Now, with the introduction to the shipping containers, that is, everything today is absolutely standardized. In today's world, as long as you can take your goods and package it in the container format, that is this container box, everything else across the globe is absolutely standardized. You can take that container, put it on a truck, put it on a train, put it on a ship. It works the same way. Um, and there are devices and the tools created specifically to manage the containers at the dockyard and so on and so forth. There are locks at the same places. There are barcodes at the same places. Everything is standardized across the globe. And that's exactly what you get with software containers that is Docker or Kubernetes, right? With Docker format, basically, as long as you take your application, now you can have any application that could be Python or Node or uh, Java. Earlier, you would handle that in a certain way. Now, as long as you can take that application, package it in the container format, the image format, everything else would be standardized across everywhere basically so you can take that same container run it on your laptop uh, the same container can is guaranteed to run in a data center or later in a cloud environment in your production environment as well so you get the absolute standardization with docker and that's why docker along with its ecosystem such as kubernetes is revolutionizing the software industry by bringing in the standardization, by bringing in the consistency, by bringing in the portability. And uh, that is, you know, that is the key theme across the containers journey, basically. Now that's about containers and dockers. Now, why do we need Kubernetes and why you should bother about it is anywhere you want to deploy a container beyond a local development environment, you definitely need and orchestration engine and the most popular and the gold standard in the world of orchestration today is kubernetes and that's the reason if you want to use or run container workloads and if you want to do that beyond development you definitely need to know about kubernetes and that's the reason why as a site reliability slash devops engineer you need to bother about containers and the ecosystem.